Redditor Fifth Circle of Nell has an explanation for Edna's peculiarity. This Redditor believes Edna was once, or still is, a villain, making a five-point argument. 1. Edna has a throwaway line about not looking back slash dwelling on the past because it's distracting. Well, what do you mean? You designed it. I never look back, darling. It distracts from the now. This may be in line with her need to forget her days of villainy. 2. She seems to be overzealous about seeing heroes in danger or witnessing dangerous combat, almost to a pathological level. Edna mode. Oh. I'm gay. Oh my god, pull oh. yourself together! Why would he keep secrets from you? He, he wouldn't. Do you know where he is? Would you like to find out? If this one is in doubt, watch her reaction to Jack Jack's suit being set on fire. This act brings her way too much joy. 3. As Fifth Circle of Nell puts it, her entire facility is somewhat villainous. The style is severe and imposing. It's equipped with auto turrets, flamethrowers, and explosive ordnance. It's surrounded by a gate and has armed guards. Now, other supers and those associated with them live in hiding, but they don't seem to feel like they're in any sort of danger in their day-to-day -day lives. She has those things because she likes them and needs them for protection from people who might be seeking revenge for villainous acts. 4. She seems to be very contemptuous of her guards, perhaps because they're actually governmental handlers as opposed to guards. Go, back, go, go check the electric fence or something. Either way, her disdain for them is somewhat villainous in and of itself. 5. She made a suit for Jack-Jack. The Pars slash Incredibles never even considered a suit for the infant. What on earth do you think the baby will be doing? But because Edna thinks like a villain, she accurately predicted Jack-Jack would become a target of syndrome. Well, I'm sure I don't know, darling. Here is another point about Edna that you might want to consider. Why did she send Elastigirl to Syndrome's island alone? Do you know where he is? Would you like to find out? Edna knew that Mr. Incredible was on the island and the fact that he was in trouble because she was tracking him the whole time. And did you ever consider why she was so insistent on making him a new suit? What have you been doing, Robert? Moonlighting hero work? This is a hobo suit, darling. Oh, you can't be seen in this. I won't allow it. This is because she wanted to be able to track him at all times. You want to make me a suit? You push too hard, darling. But I accept. My theory is, she knew that Mr. Incredible was that Central's island, and she knew why he was going there because she was in cahoots with Syndrome and the government. Money, 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 money. We, we can't keep doing this, Bob. Edna purposely sent Elastigirl to the island to die with her husband. So what did you think of this video? Let us know in the comments section below what you would like to see next. Thanks for hanging out with us here at Movie Mistakes, and we'll see you next time.